Hey everybody, this is uh, Masley with the next part of the tutorial on screen packs of the high events. Uh, screen packs that have a lot of errors. So, this is a problem that if people, if you all have trying to make Capcom vs. SNK or, you know, Marvel's Capcom or World Warriors X or whatnot, and you have this kind of error and it's telling you, you gotta fix a couple of things. Well, this is a this is this tutorial on is fixing those errors. So right now I'm getting ready to show you my Capcom vs SK screen pack. Then show you how to fix it. What is that problem? Well, there you have it. If you would like for yours to look like mine, not exactly as mine, but at least work before you put your music or anything on, this is what happens. So, first, we want to open up our music folder, a fresh new one. And you know, everything as usual is always in the same folder, of course. But the thing is, with this screen pack, it's tricky as hell. Because you know, some screen packs open up differently you minimize this but as you can see you have to make sure you copy this batch file and put it in the main thing in the Mugen folder so what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna do it this way and make sure you do it the same way as I'm doing it Alright, well, it's in my data folder. And since it's in my uh, data folder, you want to open it up. Now, make sure you copy this. Right click, you know, right click, copy. Then you would like to go back to the main front, which is this. And just paste. There you go. You're done with that. Now, go back to data. Go to game now what the tricky thing is with the FNT means F O N T font and just make it F N T for short and you know same thing as usual like the S F F those go in the data folder so this is what we're going to do we're going to make two folders we're going to name one of course data And then we want to make one as F O N T. Or what you can do is instead of doing that, you can just put these in the right places that they're supposed to go in. But instead, this is what I'm going to do I'm going to put my system, you know, all my select dot devs and stuff in the data folder. And with the F N T's. You put that in the font folder, and the rest, um, data, data, don't forget FNC is font, and that's it. Now what you want to do is, you can copy this or you can just drag and drop, but I am just want to copy it for the hell of it. Now, all you do is right click, paste, go to yes, and just keep hitting yes. And you check your font, all oh, everything should be there, which is it is. Same thing with data. See? Now that's started up now. See? The error. You can make sure you gotta read it and it'll tell you. You can't find this. Well and it tells you where it's located at. So what you do is you go to let's see, go to data. You go to system.dev then you make sure you find 
We're just telling you. Oh, see the big problem here? They're supposed to be named as pawn. So make sure you can either copy this and just. Oh, oops, excuse me. Pawn with a slash. See, yeah, all of them have to say that. See, or you know, just you know, keep going, keep going until you're done. See, let's say you're finished. Make sure at the end it says Evan Tito. Then you exit, go to yes. Alright, see, you're finished. Then all you do is now start it up. See? There you have it. With nothing though. So it's the same way that go with screen packs. If you have this error, go back with it one more time. Make sure you have all your fonts matching with the font folder. Make sure you have your system not that reading all these, you know, one through five, maybe one through eight, one through six, one through seven, you never know. And then make sure that that's F and T and the names of that file from font into this category here. So um, that's it with this tutorial. If any more questions or anything else you need help on, or when we make another tutorial on the other screen pack just to show you, please feel free to leave a comment or message me as usual. Alright, well this is Master Lee and I'm um, signing out.